Kudumbashri launched by the government of Kerala in 1998 with the aim of poverty eradication is a model for the country today due to its strong organizational structure and operational excellence Kudumbashri's back to school campaign which has been launched to revive the organizational system with time and move forward to more functional levels has made it to the global women's empowerment list 38,70,794 Kudumbashri women became learners in more than 2,000 schools of the state in the campaign held in collaboration with the Education Department on holidays from October 1 to December 31, 2023. They became school children in dress and appearance, reminiscing about their school days. Starting with assembly, learners go to the classes. The class time was from 9:30 a.m. to 4:30 p.m. Classes of 1 hour each in 5 relevant subjects. Organizational strength experience lessons. Importance of account keeping in NHG. Community life security our happiness. New knowledge, new ideas in livelihood. Digital literacy. 15,000 resource persons trained as teachers 3 months of learning was celebrated 3 lakh 11758 nhgs across the state have participated in the campaign the campaign bagged two world records india book of records and asia book of records for the largest training campaign with the largest number of women participation the inauguration of the conclusion of the back to school campaign and the launch of the follow up campaign k lift 24 kudumbashri livelihood initiative for transformation livelihood campaign was held at tiruvananthapuram shri m b rajesh minister local self government department inaugurated the project 3 lakh women will be ensured sustainable income through the project kudumbashri will provide sustainable income to nhg members and auxiliary group members by creating a means of livelihood in the form of at least one enterprise or one employment from an nhg by providing livelihood to so many women k lift 24 campaign will be a new milestone in the poverty eradication sector of kerala bas